if you open Apple Wallet and then if you would tap on add in here or the plus sign in here, Apple Wallet would give you only two options. One is to add a debit or credit card and the other is to add a travel card. What about adding any other card such as a loyalty card? So I'm going to show you two methods to add any card to your Apple Wallet. The first method is to log in to your online account of your card. You could log in using your phone's browser or you could download the company's app and log in through the app. But the most important thing is that you would do it through your iPhone. In this example, I'm using Nando's. It doesn't matter which company. The most important thing is to log in to your account that has got that card's number. Then you should find a place in your account where it says add to wallet. Usually it is located in a section called card and it is different for different companies. And then if you would tap on add to wallet because you have logged in on your iPhone it would provide this link called add to wallet tap on it then it will give you a preview of the card and then if you would tap on add it would automatically add that card to your Apple wallet now if you would open Apple wallet you could see that card is now added underneath your credit cards if you tap on it you could open it if it is a QR code or barcode type card you can scan it in this case this card is an NFC type which means just like a credit card you need to tap it on the card reader and it will be recognized but not all companies provide this add to wallet option but luckily there is another method but for this we will need to install another app and this app would help you to transfer all your cards to Apple wallet so go to the app store Tap on the search and search for store card selected. So tap on here to install it. Then tap on open to open it. Then it will ask you to use your location, which you don't need to allow. So tap on don't allow. To add a card, simply tap on the plus sign in here. Tap on search card and type the name of your card, such as TK. You don't need to type the whole name. It should find your card easily. But if it can't find your card, don't worry. Simply select the other card. But if it finds your card, simply tap on your card. To be able to allow store card to scan your card, you will need to allow it to access your camera. So tap on OK. If you're lucky and your card has got a QR code or a barcode, you could easily scan it by using your front camera. Simply move your phone in a way that the barcode comes under the camera and store card would be able to very quickly read the barcode and the number. But still double check that the number on the card and on the store card are are matching now if you tap on back you could see the card is added by the way you could directly use this app instead of Apple wallet but if you still want to use Apple wallet instead of this app then add all your cards just like I've shown you in here if you would select any card and then tap on here then you could tap on add to Apple wallet in order to make a copy of the same card onto your Apple wallet then it will give you a preview of how it will look in your Apple wallet. So simply tap on add to add this card to your Apple wallet. Now if you would open Apple wallet, you could see this card is now added. In this way, you could transfer most of your cards from store card to Apple wallet. Just bear in mind that some cards don't have this option to add to Apple wallet, but most of the cards allow you to add. So after adding all your cards from now on, you could simply just use Apple wallet. Then if you tap on store card, it will group all your cards like this one by one and now you can easily scan it now that you have added all your cards you could even uninstall store card app and just use apple wallet i hope this video was helpful if it was please don't forget to subscribe to support my channel you can find my other videos in here and if you have any questions please let me know in the comments below